my Mistlands. Um, I'm gonna start the game, and we are gonna start. I think. Um, I think we're gonna start in New World because I, I I think we need to see where I was looking with last time. It's it's been a little while, yeah. So. It's loading. Alright. And at some point, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and figure out how to do the video editing so that we'll cut off the, the parts that are, you know, like the slow loading part so you don't have to watch that when it's not live anymore. And that kind of thing. Says, don't forget to upgrade your crafting station, weapons, and armor. And I agree with that premise in general. Oh, here we are, and things are exciting here in New World. Uh, uh, here's right. Let me check what I, what I got going on for me. Here, let's look at in our inventory. Yep, I believe we have some rocks being thrown. We have rocks being thrown, so there's coal outside. Take a moment. Oh, yep, we still got some dinner going here. Let's make sure we're refreshed on that. There we go. Yep, the health. Ooh, definitely throwing rocks over there. Definitely throwing rocks over there over here and he stopped throwing rocks as soon as I came out. I have 18 fire arrows so away. Look at what what my supplies are. I got enough to make another round of arrows I think. Oh I have to have feathers. I, I would have to have feathers to do this. No, I don't. And the truth is, I much prefer having fire arrows to deal with when dealing with trolls than um, regular people. Yeah, I, I do. But what we're going to do is we're going to simplify and go to a different world. <laughs> Log out. <laughs> And then we're going to go to, actually, yep, go someplace else to make some arrows, yep. It is, it is. Let's see. I guess we'll go to Glade and see what we have there, see what our supplies are. I've only got one building there, so there might be enough feathers. Really, I, I don't need that many. I can usually get them in about uh, 20 arrows worth, but um, it's still, for me, there's a lot to shoot, so... We're going into um, Gremlin. Um, that's the place. I only have like one building there. So I'm just going to check it for feathers, you know, because really that's all I really need. There we are. 
No feathers. Empty. Empty. There's one feather. <laughs> I'll take it. You, you only need two. One one whole feather, but I'm I'm taking a moment to lighten my load here. Good. Uh, oh, there's another house that I've got over there. It says I've got another house over there. The nail. Oh no, no, that's just... I don't think, I don't think I came to Gremlin, I think I came to Clay. <laughs> well, that's, maybe it is. Well, I don't think I have a fence. But I apparently have a whole lot of rocks, which means I'm going to chase around. That means. <laughs> okay. Alright, never mind. Wrong place. <laughs> I'm trying. Well, there might be feathers up there, though. Jeez. Whoa. I gotta say, the weather effects on this game... Go back out there. Over by the other place here. Try not to up that for me there. Yeah, that was the um by the skeleton. Oh, look at the nectar out.
quite a few, yeah. Yeah, it looks like. And I don't have any bridges, but I do, I do have my very own Raspberry Pi. There's another next down there. It is kind of funny because it does seem like it works that way when you want something. I think, okay, I need birds. No, he's not around. <laughs> Eventually I have to let go, which is why that arrow went, you know, like a lot of nowhere. And right now it's just using the wood and oh, oh, another neck. They're just they're just out in forest. I guess that's something, you know, that's actually really good to know. I mean, if you need supplies and you're by the water, rain season is... That's a four over there. Alright, well, I'm going back to the house. I'm going to dry off. I know I have feathers and or fire arrows. <laughs> I did a legit storm that told me it's very much rainy right now. Switch the fire. I don't know which rule this was, <laughs> but I think it was actually um, this way. Well, the first one was New World. That's the one where, you know, I actually have a whole bunch of houses, but I'm just currently in that one because that's where the trolls at. Yeah, I was in Glade. So, let's try, um, try good world. <laughs> All we want are feathers. We're not trying anything major. Yep, I have four total worlds going on right now. I have, um... Yes, I, I just texted hi back to to uh, Salem Games zero four zero eight. Hi. I guess it's Salem Games. Okay, Salem. <laughs> like the city. <laughs> Yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you're enjoying it. It's a little, it's low key play when I play, so there's nothing too uh, too strenuous, I think. But hopefully, fun anyway. All right. Well. Checking the woodshed. The woodshed might have some stuff. I know I'm realizing that it's possible that I might not actually have any feathers. I, uh, <laughs> I did make some arrows in the past, and they might actually all be gone. <laughs> Which means I might have to go 
actually do some hunting. Birds. I said nope and then more nope because of um, my uh no feathers essentially. The thing that I was looking for was not there. So. Alright, at least it's not raining here, so we're gonna come on out to the side door here. Now I know for a fact there's a troll going down the road that way, so we're just basically gonna wander around it. <laughs> Go down the hill. No, I. It usually takes me about twenty to twenty-five arrows to really get a troll down with the fire arrows. It would probably take forty to fifty if I were using just the regular arrows, um, just because of the amount of of, of points. Uh, fire, you know, what it does is it continues to burn. Whereas just shooting at him with a regular wooden arrow or a flint arrow, that's just the damage that it does is what it does. You know. And and I'd be okay, except that it's not my strongest shoot using bows. Although I've gotten a lot, lot better. In fact, let's take a moment now that we're kind of safe on the road here. And I could show you that my bow skill is at 14, which is amazing because it was at like nothing before you know? <laughs> you know so um it's not as good as my uh, uh wood chopping skill uh, you saw me first it, but it is definitely there's been progress has been made oh yeah i have been kind of walking around a bit haven't i all right let's have a little dinner here and I'm going into my inventory and pressing X to select uh, what I'm eating. And in this case, I'm kind of trying to maximize everything, both my uh, stamina and my health, by um, just kind of keeping it balanced. Um, yeah, it'll go up slowly. It's, it's one of those, it, it will go up. So here's my hut over here. That that was the first one. The one that has all my houses is, is really uh, on New World. There, this is, this is Good World. This is kind of like it's sort of got out. Um, but the troll has taken up residence by my my current location <laughs> and very closely to. Which is why I'm laughing, because it's like, really? <laughs> right, let me take a look at my map here. Go a little closer. Okay, so the next place I want to go is to the tent. But I know that over here, there's another troll over here. So we're just going to... Uh, this one I know has a couple of... Uh, But I think you may be right. What may be happening here is that I have maybe gone through all my feathers. Um, none. You have to have two feathers. So, um, which is why I'm looking for another feather, yes. Because really, I only need like one more to just make this a more successful experience. But it's just—he he won't have feathers, but he will have resin, which you also use for fire arrows.
here's the pen. And there's the other troll, that little blue. You can barely see him, but he's behind the trees. He can't see me either, because he's behind the trees. So that's, that's good. We won't, we won't tempt fate by going and bothering him. We're just here to check. Just check, yeah. No feathers. None whatsoever. I guess we're not going trolling until I can spend some time uh, going hunting and, and getting some. And maybe hunting is the way to go. But what I am going to do is I'm going to go back to the central... Um... Oh no. I know you'll chase me down, otherwise I'd... Thank you for your meat. The neck was... The, the neck was right there. I was walking past him. And he was like, oh, I It is water over here, yeah, I'm just kind of following the... I, because I can, I'm just sort of following this to see if I can see a seagull along the way. This, this edge wasn't affected quite as much as the other one with the update. Yeah, well, because I wasn't near any bees. There's none of the, um, none of the places I've been so far have had. Well, except for that one, except for the first one. Yeah, yeah, I didn't check that, check that one, did I? Yeah, you're right, I didn't quite check that one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sorry, sir, I was just walking. That means it's there. Dwarf, uh, great here. I, I wasn't paying attention to where I was going. It's essentially, and he just popped up right in front of me. Yeah, this is really interesting to me because usually by now, when you're sort of semi by the water, there are tons of birds. There's been a whole lot of no on that. And I, and I do wonder if it's because of that one update, you know, that just kind of changed the landscape so much that it just hasn't adopted or adapted. Standing there, minding his own business. I may have already been by this too. Let me go take a look. Oh, I'm sure I've been by it. Yep, there's the workbench.
Looks like that might be a rune stone. A short one. About travelers. Yeah, it adds to the story. It's not really showing me like, you know, this is where the boars are, or this is where the graves are. I don't think I've seen this one though. I don't think I've seen a house on the stilts with stairs. And there is a there's a honey. That means I've added a few points. I added a few points to my arrows. And I should now have a queen bee in there somewhere. Oh, I got honey. There it is. I got the queen bee. And I'm, I'm going to leave this house here in case another one generates. Because sometimes they do. But what I might do is mark it on the map. No, it doesn't look like it. Because I was thinking there might be a chest, but no, it was just straight up. Um, just, just a nice place for honeybees to hide out. That does look like honey up there, though. It was too high for me to get. Jump up here. Right. I'm trying not to have to build something, in case you're wondering what's going on here. Or break it. I just leave it. It's, it's okay. I guess the important part. What we're doing now is kind of exploring because um, on the mini map, which uh, I know is kind of hard to see at the very far, far right hand corner, is we're just kind of going and, and following the, the brown line here. And just looking around. Oh, that looks like a dwarf thing. That is a, that's one of those fortresses. They're gonna have skeletons and and there's a bird. There's a couple of birds. Just tempting me over there. Yep, yep, you're right. That's a black forest over there. So those would be crows up there. Because in the Black Forest they have crows, and by the Good Forest, if there's water, they have seagulls. There's Neck over there by the river. big over there. There's raspberry. If you go in quiet, the troll may not come out. I found out that trolls do not like noise. 
They really, really don't. Like... Well, now I'm just gonna put on the map here. Um, I'm just gonna put a little fire there and put, um... Wharf. And then I can come back and, and maybe clear it out, or... But I'm just... I'm more inclined to just sort of mark it down for later, is what I'm trying to say. What I'm going to kind of do here is follow back along the water. Um, just because it'll get me closer to my my house over here. Looks like there's like a war kind of thing over there, which makes sense. There's a little house over there. I found the treasure thing. It flew away as soon as I even pulled up the bow. And I'm like, it's so far away, how did it even see me? But it did. Just shoot the ground. Oh, oh I was going to say, it's going to leave me alone, but apparently not, no. Yeah, apparently it's just gonna happen. Well, that was actually kind of fun. I did enjoy it. I do like exploring in this game. And I'm kind of looking forward to it. There was a... a a minor announcement apparently on Twitter that they're planning on adding different kinds of um, levels like easy hard hardest and then there's like a creative mode and a uh, they're like sliders so you can decide if you want to be attacked or not attacked and it's just I'm, I'm kind of actually really looking forward to that that sounds like um, more fun for me because sometimes I just want to wander around the map and look around, you know, and uh, find places and or make little discoveries, right? Sometimes, of course, I also just want to build, um, and sometimes I just uh, sometimes I do want to go out and fight the trolls, not right now, obviously. All right, here we go. Wait, before I go out. Yeah, you know, that's the, I think so too. So what we're gonna do now, now that I've uh, uh, saved, is we're gonna go back to New World. And we're gonna see, now that the troll walked away from the house, and now that we know the troll will walk away from the house, <laughs> I'm going to see if I can exit the location and then go back to one of my other houses and see if I can't find any uh, fire sticks or feathers there. No! 
well, no, because, you know, obviously the, the one place that I was at, the, the troll, it showed up after the update. You know? <laughs> you know? Like, that was where I was going to hang out, but I, it, it's in an odd location because it has three black forests, some good wood, and it just... No, it did. It's just that um, I didn't have all of the, <laughs> the trolls coming out at the same time, you know? I, I have not, so we're gonna go see if we can check out. Yeah. Oh, I did. I got doors on both ends. Yeah. Alright, so... We are going to just sort of... Come on out. Out. See how the beer is doing. Troll has wandered away, thank goodness. Let me check my bees, because they did get hit. Or they were in. Oh no, they did get it. Poor little bee. Well, the queen bee is still there. I'll have to build the hut again. We'll come back and fix all this later. We're gonna take a walk. <laughs> Yep, I do. We'll just hold on to her for a little while. I am gonna go this way. For the, and then I'm gonna turn. What I'm gonna do is take a moment and come in a little closer. In the direction I'm facing. And we're going to try and head back towards Small Haven. Alright. If you're going into the good woods, we'll just take the axe with us. You have to be hammer if we need it. Apparently, you can kind of dig for treasure with the big axe. You can kind of ping for it um, if you have it. And while it may not dig to the ground, it might find out where the treasure is. a lot of rocks along the way. I think that um, when I make the path, and I'm gonna make path, I'm gonna try and, you know, like, get a couple of these food zones. Of course, this world has always been food friendly. So far, yeah. If you leave me alone, I'll leave you alone. Oh, no, he's definitely not me. Time to bring out the fire. love that when you're running, if you're just running and you happen to run into a rock, what it seems to automatically do is have you run up and over the rock. That amuses me. Yeah, I got that one marked. Okay, we're getting close. You know, every realm, I think, has its own point of light and dark, you know, it depends on where you are and when you are. Yeah, the, 
different time zones, yep. Yep, and we are here very successfully. Uh, I'm glad I had had fire with me. has wood. A lot of these may just have wood. Oh, 15. I will take those. I had some fire sticks here. So I had 15 there. That's very nice. But those are the, the fire arrows. There. I guess I don't really need to be holding this. I'm at my own place now. I feel cold. I feel cold. <laughs> Plenty of fire going on there. Good. Okay. Got wood and food. Oh, here are the feathers. I am carrying stuff. Some of this is going to go away just if I, I make the fire arrow. There we go, 93 should be present. And I am gonna put here. I do, I have 11 feathers left, so I have plenty to work with for next time. New Haven, yep. That is correctly what I'm doing, yes. They are there. Do I have two places where I've got mushrooms? I do. Let's take some of this over there. I, I am going to go ahead and spawn here because it's a little less dangerous and I can go figure out the trolls. Control situation later, you know. That that's what I'm doing. I'm I'm organizing just a little bit here. Well, it's, it's nice right now outside, you know, so it's take advantage of it, kind of. Yeah. Alright, let's do some cooking. I'm, I'm trying to do some cooking. You have to be so close, but not close. Too close. Um, over by this fire here. It's really dark in here. I'm gonna have to do this one. I usually do have far more light going on in my, my house. Where they're so close, the fire does. I may have to rebuild this whole thing. And, and that fire's got such a weird little angle because I think it's too short. I think it's, it's high enough I don't 
asphyxiate, but low enough that if I get too close, I do asphyxiate. <laughs> chair you mean oh yeah it's, it's been a little while since I've had a dream of any sort yeah but I think I think we actually I think they sometimes happen when you've had some sort of progress you know like you down move the map a little bit Yeah, let's go see how, how the deer is. Because this is the one with the deer. There, there, there's the deer. She is hanging out over there by the workbench and being just pleasantly happy of it. She's just nice and relaxed, no running around. And we're gonna leave. The pet is safe. Yes. The pet is safe. That's basically what we want. She, she may be wild, but she's my wild, you know? Alright, so, awesome. Down the, down the stairs a little bit, and then I'm gonna put some of this stuff I'm carrying around in here. Some of the extra stuff I'm just putting in here, the meat. Yep. Maybe I'll make the honeybees up there, because I don't think this one has honeybees over here. Maybe put them down here. By some sort of bush. Yep, and the answer is this area does not have bushes. That's kind of the problem there. I don't want to get too too close to her because it'll just you know disturb her. Well, it had to bore enclosure previously. There is. You can see it in the di distance over there. There he is. Holy cow! That's like having lunch over there. Like, there's a whole bunch of necks trying to climb up that wall. <laughs> like, a whole bunch of these. <laughs> you cannot have my single bush up there, no. <laughs> yep, they... They were being led up the hill there. <laughs> Trying, anyway. <laughs> and I'm, I'm guessing it's because we did have that big rain. I made things so things could get down, not so that they could get up. That's what happened here. <laughs> All right, just a second. The power of the of the hoe is gonna make this a little better here. They are indeed after the fruit. Yes. There we go. And so am I actually. So we're gonna see if I can level. I may have to go back and start finding rocks and then just make another bridge. And and the bees would definitely be safe up here. Yeah. 
I mean, and when I get the other hoe where I can plant, like, grass seeds, you know. And there's something over there. Over, over on that other, like, wood or something. There's something over there. But it's so high up, I, I'm going to have to... This is as high as this will go, and as round as it will You can sort of fool it into adding room up to it. And then after a certain point, it won't add it. I do, and I think that- I think those might be fish. Yeah, but, but, I could. <laughs> the sigh you just heard was me shooting at the bird and just watching it as do away. I'm pretty sure there is. I'm pretty sure there's like, you know, just some small thing that must One workbench. Two workbenches. No, not, not two workbenches. Just, just one was fine. <laughs> that again. Here. Bill, we want one of those little post things. If you want the... It does. The, 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 the hammer is not too bad. It just... Yeah, I won't let me repair it anyway. Gotta have to I'm out of wood now. It'll have to be the one for right now. I'm just gonna leave the workbench here. I suspect I've got some work to do in general anyway. Just to get all these sort of things connected a little bit. Yeah, the, when you make the bee hut, the bee automatically fills in Um, I will be able to, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk around and I'm gonna start gathering up like a whole bunch of rocks and, and some wood. The some wood has to do with the fact that I just need some in general to make a bee house. Um, but the reason I want a whole bunch of rock is because you need a whole bunch of rock to make those bridges. Oh dear, here comes the... And the critters. Now, I don't mind x -theaters. Now, when, when the other ones come, then I'm gonna be like, oh no, but with these dudes, it's just the boar and the, and the, um, the x -theater. It's, it's lunch. It's just Thank you for the meat. Hi. And resin. There'll be resin. I honestly think that it's of the, the rallies that they have, you know, I guess all of them are going to have something. Like, there's going to be a point where you get a troll rally, and that was gonna be like, um, lots, yeah, lots of gold and, and stuff. And so, I guess, really, this is a blessing, even if it's a hassle, <laughs> you know? And, and maybe that's a little real life, too, when you're having some of those, uh, Yeah, there's still 
rallying. If this is really the first time I've had a right as they come in. Now they're retreating, it says they'll be calming down. So there's there's one that's coming down the hill, but they might run out. You know, I bet you I have a bunch of stuff over there, too. <laughs> over at that house. Um, there's probably, like, you know, food and hide or something. putting it away for right now. We'll put the B away too, yeah. I think what I might do is go on a little walkabout, check out the other house real quick, see what they've got in it. Because now that I need rocks, I'm going to go get some. probably grab the rock pile here a while back. Well, you could tell we had weather. bad first bridge ever. Yeah, well, this is true. Yeah, the, the whole place did change on me because of that update. So, the fact that I, I had to think around the problem was actually kind of... kind of cool. Go to camps. The fire is out. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and leave the fire out because I'm not staying overnight here. I'm checking the contents of my chest. Nope, no rocks. I, I think I've been on a rock hunt around here before. <laughs> I didn't see any feathers either. Yeah, no. But, Yep, lots of food. Oh, there's a deer. Sorry, deer. Clean up around here a little bit. I wonder how far this little grayling is just trailing me. <laughs> oh, the grayling. I have. I suspect that the grayling's been trailing me for a little while. 
I just didn't notice it because I'm busy. <laughs> I saw that, so the thing is, when you stop feeling rested, it means that, like, some of the side benefits of being rested, like, oh, I don't know, better aim and, and more skills, like, better power and all that, that just kind of fades away. So, it does mean that I'm going to take a moment to stop here, where it looks like, um, I do have my fire still running. Here and how yeah, much wood I got in the fire? Oh, five. Oh, I apparently had a big stop here. Oh, chest here. Okay, I got, yeah, I got loads of supplies over here. I did, yeah. I got five feathers here and a hundred uh, fire arrows. So this is where the fire arrows are in the first house. It is not called first house. It is called, well, I guess it's home one is what it's called. I also have a hundred flint arrows here. Sorry, what? And feathers. Yeah, I had five feathers here. So, right now, technically speaking, in New World, I know I have 16 feathers. You know. Good to know. Now, a lot of these feathers I got, um, because I, um, Yeah, mostly through fighting and through, like, dropping trees. That's how I've got it. But if you're wondering if I killed the bird, no. <laughs> oh, wait! There are bees here. Let's go check our bees. There's gonna be... There will be honey here. my first bees, technically speaking, I built them a little too close to each other, and yet these bees have stayed happy, because they've also had plenty of room around them otherwise. And they're far enough away from the fence that um, whatever, like, throws random objects at them, they can't be hit, necessarily. Also, I'm near the good forest, so there's no chance of a troll coming and getting them, so... Those are probably my happiest bees and the happiest place they could be. No pun intended. Right, what did I do? I came, I came back in for a reason? Oh yeah. I have no resin. Well, I used it all. And I refilled some of those torches.
Oh, no, I didn't. But then I haven't visited very often, so it, I should be pretty okay. You know, not, not too bad. They have not had trolls literally throwing rocks at them. No. <laughs> so, so they should be all right. Okay, well, there's a few items here, but no stone. Oh, a couple of feathers here. So that's at least two that I know about that I haven't, so about three right now that are kind of in storage and not being used yet, so I think what I might do is, uh, oh, there's neck. I'm, I'm going to try not to bother these little necks. They, they aren't bothering me. I'm gonna, oh, oh, they're here. There's a bird. They're all showing up now that I'm kind of wandering around. They are daring, aren't they? Do you see this bird? They know I can not in anything. Yep, there it went. Just like that. But what it also tells me is if I'm looking for birds, this is the place, you know what I mean? And it might be because I don't have the torches to Maybe it looks like a scary for him. Three feathers in there. Yeah, three feathers in there. I might actually grab these feathers. Got dandelions. I forgot about the mud slide here. This this one had the big mud slide. You recall uh, when we had the big weather. Chests are like half buried, and I can't really unbury them until I get an axe. Yeah, no, there's no bees here. But there's a lot of uh, fish. Oh, there's a deer over there. Second time I had to re recalibrate there. Wow, a lot of flint has come back up. Flint. I, I picked this area clean some time ago, so that's actually it's good news in a way because it means that you know things like the stone and flint will come back if you pick an area clean. And, and maybe it's just also that implication that the water, when it rises, it brings stuff up with it. You know, kind of like when there's storms and there's a whole bunch of branches on the ground. I saw Now, this 
this is only up here if I had this witch stack here. Yeah, I did. I did. Um, yeah, I got the I got the meat and the, and the deer head here. This this river here is brand new. by the grayling, so it's, it's going to move on. There's neck over there. The, the hunting's good, I mean, today. This used to be a house here. used to be a house here. It's got pieces of wood going on and the flat area here. moment and look at where I'm at here on the map. It says potential here. It says a hut here, which means it's underwater. There's dandelions. There's, I, I'm a little ways from the camp, so I've basically gone full circle. But I haven't found another house. Um, so what I'm going to do is I am going to turn around. <laughs> Evening, we're getting on evening. Yep. Yep. I, th I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna head back to the triangle house and maybe call it good there because we've been on for a little while. Sorry, there were no trolls. I may have to rename this one because there was definitely no trolls. Yeah, a lot of hunting now. I did find some feathers, yes. They're all here in New World is where they are. The only way to get better at the bow is to use it, so I'm just gonna have to use, use it as my main weapon. This place could probably use it. Let me check my pocket. I was checking my pocket, but I realized I didn't bring one with me. So.
All the other, yeah, and the water. Yeah, that's kind of a really good point. No, I, I'll have to have a pick to dig them out. Buried under. Which is maybe not bad for the meat, because it's preserving the meat here, so. Uh, we'll say that it's cooler there, and so it's working well for us right now. I am. I am. Buried under. All right. So that also does tell me this is also evidence that this is a good hunting area. Just Alright, I'm gonna set the spawn point, and we're gonna go to sleep, and then when we get up, we're gonna log off, and I'm gonna say thank you for watching. And I am gonna practice with the bow for a while on some of my off time, I think, so that uh, we can get better at dealing with the, the trolls that are very close to me. watching. That was kind of fun. <laughs>